This video shows you how to download and install NVIDIA's GE Force experience. NVIDIA's GE Force experience allows someone to download drivers uh, automatically, install drivers, reinstall drivers. The GE Force experience includes many other features that you can find useful. First thing that we'll need to do is download NVIDIA's GE Force experience. So first, go to NVIDIA's website, then go to Drivers, then GE Force Drivers. After clicking GE Force Drivers, you can get NVIDIA's GE Force experience. There's also a manual driver search but this video does not cover this option. So if you click download now, the GeForce experience will start to download. If you click the GeForce button, you'll have to click download now on the next page. After downloading the GeForce experience, you'll need to open up your download. Depending on where you have your downloads is where you'll find this download. You can also probably just click it in your browser as seen here. After starting the installation, a UAC will pop up. You must click yes to continue. After the GeForce experience loads, you have to agree and install to continue the installation. After it finishes installing, you'll have to have an account to use the NVIDIA GeForce experience. So you either need to create an account or just sign in if you already have an account. After navigating to the Drivers tab, you'll be able to download and install NVIDIA's graphics drivers. To download a graphics driver, just click the download button in the upper right hand corner. If you already have one downloaded and you're up to date, it should not be an option. After it is downloaded, you will have an option of clicking Express installation or custom installation. The express installation is simpler while the custom installation gives you a couple of options. Then you'll have to click yes on another UAC. Again, this is required. After the installation is complete, you have your new NVIDIA graphics driver. The following are other features that I will explain. You can click check for updates to see if you are at the latest version for your graphics card. You can also reinstall graphics drivers in case if you need to reinstall it if it's corrupt or other reasons. You do this by clicking the little three dots and then clicking reinstall driver. To automatically have new driver updates download, you can do this by clicking the settings icon on the top right and then scrolling to the bottom of your page, going to the download section and checking the box that says automatically download driver updates. That's all in this video.